Hey guys, and welcome back to another uh, part of Let's Play Odd World, uh, Munch's Odyssey. And uh, last time we did the fuel fields level, which took about a half hour to do. And whoa, what the hell? Um, well, uh, yeah. That's pretty cool, I guess. I thought it was like further up the wall, that's why I got all excited. Anyway. But now we're going to do uh, Magog Motors, which I've already recorded this part, but uh, the recording, I don't know what happened, um, so I had to like delete that recording and everything, but I had saved, but the good thing was, though, is that I had uh, quick saved at some point in the recording, so um, I wasn't really in that bad of a position. But anyway, he just tells you about the new security and everything for here, and I don't really feel like hearing him talk. I just want to get this recording done as soon as possible. But anyway, so I'm like redoing this level and everything, which sucks. I hate redoing things. Um, but anyway, so this level isn't really that hard. Um, there are multiple ways you can deal with it. Um, I'm just going to do it in what I think is the easiest and safest way. Um, and I'm going to start out by using Abe to take out a bunch of sligs that are um, surrounding a bridge that we need to get through. Um, this door leads to the bridge that I'm talking about, and there are a bunch of sligs through this door, and there's also, on the bridge, there's a bunch of mines, and there's sligs surrounding the bridge, so it's really not all worth opening that door and everything, so if I were you, I would just, you know, ignore that and just do what I'm doing, because, you know, you can save yourself tons and tons and tons of trouble. Alright, so we don't want to go that way yet because there are some sligs that we're going to want to take care of. First, I'm going to grab me some spoos. And don't be wasting the spoos because you only get a limited number of it. So. Yeah, now, uh, let me show you the bridge real quick. Um, as you can see, there are some big bro sligs and there's like two armored sligs up on these like tower platform things. And as you can see on the bridge, there's like a bunch of mines, and it's just, it's all crazy. Um, and we don't really want to deal with that. So, um, I guess the way they intended you to take care of these guys was to use these uh, bone powder kegs. And just kind of take them and throw them onto the towers and knock whatever is on the tower off. But I'm not going to do that because that's not very fun. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to come over here. And through this corridor, there's like a little way leading to the opposite side of this area. And there are two just normal sligs just hanging out. So we'll, what, what I'm going to do is come over here and I'm going to possess one of them. So get this guy. I'm not going to kill the other one quite yet because just in case I happen to mess up with this slig, I can have um, some sort of security knowing that, you know, I don't have to redo the level or do this another way. So, uh, first off, you're going to want to... What I'm going to do, actually, you can do this, like I said, any way you want to, but I'm going to start by just shooting off all the sligs on these platforms. So there's six sligs I'm going to need to take care of, plus that big bro slig that's kind of just hanging out there. As you can see, I'm, I'm pretty sure we've seen big, big bro sligs in this game uh, up to this point, but if we haven't, well, then the big guys down there are big bro sligs. But anyway, so let's go ahead and start shooting. And, uh... Shit, my controller died. Generally, you should be okay with uh, being shot. As long as you don't sh uh, shoot something, it, sh it, shouldn't shoot it shouldn't shoot back at you. But apparently this big bro slig is uh, a douchebag and wants to shoot at um, anything that moves. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to kill him with this uh, normal slig. And as you can see, these guys are pretty powerful and they can take a lot. So, anyway, we kill him and uh, there's no guys in this break. And then we got two more sligs. And uh, well, actually we got four more, but... Now, uh, okay, well I'm kind of like alternating my fire, which I guess is nice. Although I didn't intend for it to do that. Ooh, and I'm probably going to die, so I should probably just be careful. Alright. So, the way I was doing this in my uh, other recording was that actually I was only able to shoot 
things that were on the opposite side of wherever I was shooting from. No, don't. Ah, uh, okay. That's okay. I took out half the sligs with the that one slig, so I guess it's kind of okay. But uh, yeah, I was like shooting whatever slig from the opposite direction. Wait a sec. I think we're missing a slig. What happened to this guy? I wonder. He didn't die, did he? He must have moved or something. I didn't think they moved. The hell? I didn't kill him, so he must have... Huh, I don't know. Doesn't really matter. Um, let me just try to look for him again. Because I could have swore there was two slicks, unless I'm crazy and, you know, blind. Let's see, maybe he, uh... Maybe he just ran past me, ran over here, and tried to take out this slig. Then to get... There he is. He's over there. Yeah, that's what I thought. I kind of thought that he had, uh, ran over here to take out this slig, which I don't understand why he'd do that, but oh well. Okay, well, anyway, that saves me a little bit of trouble. So... Alright, so let's kill this guy this time. Alright. So there we go. We still got this guy to take care of. Okay. Wait, what? I didn't know they respond. Huh. Oh well. I guess if they respond, it's not really that big a deal. Anyway, so there are eight scrubs in this level. Um, all of them up on this, um, part of the level. Um, and there's four on each side, as if you, if you couldn't see already. Anyway, this is the side that I want to be on, but I just grabbed these slugs, or these scrub, scrubs first. But that's okay. But I'm going to come over here and grab these guys first, or these guys next. And then what we're going to want to do is go to Munch, and he will open the way for that we, where we need to go next. Hey, what's happening? Hey, hey. But the hey, reason why we want to take out the sligs hey, is uh, not because we're gonna we're not gonna go on the bridge, hey, there. which is like the only hey, um, place where the sligs are a main threat. Hey, but we're not gonna go on the bridge. But um, crossing up here is a lot easier when you don't have um, the risk of sligs shooting you or your scrubs. So. And plus, we do need to get Munch into that water and around the towers that um, the sligs were on. And we definitely don't want him getting shot and dying. But uh, that's kind of a hard thing to do, so it's not really that easy to die. So anyway, let's make sure we have all eight scrubs and switch back to Munch. And some, like, old-looking guy just, like, passed my window. That's not creepy at all. Oh, DJ Jive! Jeez, what are you doing, man? Creeping around my uh, window. <laughs> uh, anyway. <laughs> so, um, uh, yeah. What we need to do... I'm not... Uh, I don't know why I grabbed Zap. I honestly don't need that. <laughs> I can't believe I said that. Uh, that's so funny. Um, anyway. But, uh, yeah, so... We do need Bounce, though. And we need to... Um, come over to, I believe, the left side? I, I think it's on the left side um, of the Brit. Okay, maybe it's on the right side. I can't really see around. Yeah, it's on the right side. Okay, so come to the right side of the bridge and look for 
a big ass tower, which is this one right here. And we want to jump and get on top of it before our bounce runs up. Because we don't want to have to go back. Then we want to pull this lever. And that'll open the door where I took all my scrubs. Where they're all waiting. And then we can move on and move forward. And all all we gotta do from here is save our scrubs and then deal with the Gluckin. And uh but we have to get our guys over some mines and some crazy stuff. But it's not that hard. I'll be back. Don't you worry. So how many scrubs? Okay, I still have eight, just making sure. Alright, so jump over this wall of uh this wall of mines and then take this conveniently placed bone powder keg. And then just to toss it over here and blow up the wall. And that'll allow us to uh, get our scrub buddies down here. Everybody listen. Hey, 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 Alright, hey, um, but as you can see we got mines and I guess if there was another bone powder keg you could uh, probably blow it up. Do I dare even try that? Do I dare even try that? Um, I dare. I'm gonna dare. Hey, you jumps. I'm gonna try this and hopefully it works out um, in my favor. Okay, so tell the guys to wait here. And either you can be stupid and try what I'm going to try or just pick up all of your guys one by one and just toss them over the mines. Um, which is what I did in my past recording, so... Hey, maybe this will be a good change. We got some mines. This is gonna be stressful. Uh, no, I'll quick save once I get through them. And if I don't get through them... Well then, oh well. Alright. I could have jumped over him, but what's the fun in that? Okay, I don't want to save, save. I want to quick save. Alright. Oh, Jesus Christ. Alright, let's see. Okay, turn around. Walk very slowly. Can I... Uh, no, probably it's better safe to go through here. Ah, I made it. Okay. Well, that's not so bad. Okay, so I'm going to actually blow up these mines. That's what I'm going to do. No, no, controller. Don't fuck up on me. No. The mines are going to respawn. Ah. Oh. Ain't that a crock of... Uh. Damn controller. Oh, what the hell? It's like saying it's, uh, whatever. Right, I definitely need to buy a new controller at some time in the future. Okay, let's try this again, I guess. Alright. Okay, got the mine, got the mine, got the mine. Or got the, the powder keg the keg. I got a very sensitive keg of beer and I don't want it to explode and waste it. Alright. Okay. Why did I have to put them all the way back there? I don't know. Okay, can I do this again without it dying? I'm going to quick save just in case. Alright. Hurry before they come back. Okay, they all got across safely. That's good. Alright. So let's save all of our scrubs, and that's all eight scrubs in this level. Alright, definitely one of the easier scrub saving levels in this section of the game. Alright, so now the last thing we need to do, obviously, is get us some more moolah from this uh, Gluckin. So there we go. This guy has a hundred thousand moolah, which you can check using the same the same way that you would check your spoose. So that's good. Eighty thousand, a hundred thousand. He was rich, and now he's sad. I'm sorry, mama. What's your mom gonna care? 
All right, so we're done with Abe, and now we just need to very simply get um, Munch over to where we are. And all we have to do is uh, make him jump up on the platform where the exit is, and then that's it. You don't have to make him cross the bridge or anything, and you don't even need bounce for it. Just need to do that, and there we go, end of the level. Wait, I think there was a de uh, uh, dang it. Hey, I, I noticed that it only does that when I'm recording. Like, it won't do that if I'm just playing the game. I wonder why. Maybe Fraps is just messing with things. Anyway, so, uh, that's it for this part. And, uh, the next level is a pretty long level, even if you know what you're- wait, wait, what level is this? Oh, this wasn't the level I'm thinking of, but I know it's still- slightly long anyway but next time on let's play odd world much as odyssey we move on and do the dead river level so see you guys next time bye